let's do a new exercise gear reducer housing this is a kind of housing all dimensions are in millimeter material cast alloy steel now let's say this is our front view and this is top view and we will start from bottom and go gradually now let's start with bottom start width 66.675 and the length you will see in this section view this is side view and we took a section view for side and 152.4 and the depth of this 6.35 okay then gradually move we will move upside this width 101.6 the thickness is similar 66.675 and the length goes 88.9 okay let's do this first i am going to select here top plane sketch now activate center rectangle now click at center point and drag and let's apply 66.675 press tab key and the, it will move to another one 152.4 enter press escape key to out now see similarly go to feature and activate extruded boss base feature now is from we will keep same direction one this is end condition and here i am going to apply 6.35 this is the thickness of this flange say okay okay now again select this face sketch activate same center rectangle start from origin point because origin lies at center and i am going to click this line simply press tab key and the length here shows 101.6 enter press escape key to out now these vertical length similar to previous and this is the length going to change now activate again extruded boss base feature start condition we will keep same we are not going to change any plane but direction let's say blind it is moving upside see if you can click and drag arrow now here we have to put the dimension and this is 88.9 see okay 88.9 now let's apply fillet at this corner you will see this top view there is a cross section b come down this is cross section b now corner radius 6.35 this corner radius let me zoom 6.35 see and these holes lies at center point of this corner holes okay now 3.18 this is going to be do at end and uh, there is one cut out you will see in section view uh, detail view you will see this side wall 6.35 this wall size 9.525 and the depth of this cut out is just parallel to this outer face okay i am going to select one edge and it will appear fillet fillet type constant size now here i am going to choose all the edges now come to fillet parameters and here let's say 6.35 now i am going to select this edges even hidden edges also you can choose just move cursor see okay now here uh, we will apply at the end okay let's apply fillet this time 3.18 let's say this corner select this edge similarly i am going to apply this corner and this corner see okay now select the top face sketch now here let me choose again center rectangle press escape key to out activate the smart dimension now here i am going to see this dimension 6.35 okay and distance from here to this outer 9.525 mm okay 
if you see now you will see go to feature and activate extruded cut feature this time plane i am going to keep same we are not going to change anything now from here direction one i am going to select up to surface now here i have to select one surface up to this surface because the hole is collinear with this surface see if i am going to select inside edge fillet and this is going to be 3.81 see let's select move cursor and select edges say yes now look we have 12 number of holes 1 by 4 inch 20 number of thread per inch you can see through so let's do this first this inside uh, diameter 87.15 this is a throughout hole and similarly things we are going to mirror in opposite direction select this face sketch now activate circle and let me draw one circle and the diameter goes to the 82.55 enter press escape key to out smart dimension center distance from outer edge 47.625 okay let's make one relation press and hold shift key select this center point and origin point if you leave your uh, shift you will see this pop up or this side vertical extrude now here keep end condition blind and depth is 6.35 okay now here i want to make a hole so simply sketch activate circle and the hole diameter is 57.15 enter press escape key to out now select this outer edge circle hold shift key this inner circle and make this relation concentric see activate extruded cut feature now this time i am going to select up to next this is going to cut up to inside wall that's it now here i am going to make a hole so let me go to hole wizard now here i am going to choose a straight tap inch now i want to make throughout hole to this wall so keep bottoming tapped hole now here i am going to define 1 by 4 into 20 unc now this is up to next so we don't need to define any dimension i want to see with thread call out position now select this face now we have to press somewhere here press just uh, let me do one thing draw one circle and let's keep this diameter 69.85 enter now make sure we selected for construction now click this point and activate and place somewhere this point press escape key to out look now if you want to see go to option documents property detailing shaded cosmetic thread and see this is visible thread now i want to make six number of so select circular pattern now here let me choose one circular edge so i am going to select this equal spacing 360 degree because i want to cover this hole six number of instances and feature is already selected say okay now the same all thing we are going to mirror on opposite direction front plane mirror now here select feature what feature first this one and that's it you forget just edit 
and add here circular pattern say okay look see now let's add this body you will see section detail now this is the detail view 19.905 from top this outer diameter 25 per 4 then there is a hole 14.605 and this is little tolerance plus one 0.127 and corner fillet 3.18 and uh, this is also 3.18 and where here also 3.18 okay let's do this and we will mirror this same thing in opposite direction i am going to select this face sketch now activate circle and let me draw here a circle and keep the diameter 25.4 enter press escape key to out smart dimension and distance from top 19 point this is the dimension 05 enter is still not defined so let me hold origin point and center of circle vertical this is important relation extrude now this depth in drawing it's 12.7 okay now let's make a hole the hole diameter shows 14.605 enter press escape key to out now make at center so press and hold shift key select both the circles collinear now here if you want to see three digit here tolerance bilateral here 0 0.127 see this is what we want to achieve extruded cut feature and here i am going to select end condition or direction one up to next up to next means inside wall see let me select here mirror reference right plane now feature to mirror this extruded boss base and extruded cut say okay see here now you will see there is four threaded hole at top you will see now come down in detail view see here four number of hole diameter depth 11 millimeter and this is the thread dimension 632 thread per inch unc depth of thread is 7 okay let's do this and here also you will see the position of this hole is just center of this corner circle so we will do the same hole wizard i'm going to choose tab and see tab not tabbed bottoming hole tabbed hole now here 632 this is our dimension blind depth is 11 okay up to shoulder not up to tip now thread 7 option i want to see the thread with call out position let's select this face now i want to press at center just keep cursor over edge and you will see one positive sign this is the center point of this edge click similarly i'll do for all corner okay press escape key to out of selection now look at bottom it it shows fully defined say okay see okay it's time to apply material right click edit material and this is going to be cast alloy steel you will see all the properties apply 
close see now I want to change appearance so simply from here appearance color edit appearance from here and any color you want to apply simply do it okay that's it okay let's uh, we add to okay we forget to add some fillet activate fillet fillet type constant size now here let me choose first uh, let me here add 3.18 I'm going to select one two opposite direction okay now here we forget to add these holes you will see in this section view section bb there is a oblong holes 9.525 12.7 from one end and uh, the center distance between two oblong 31.75 you'll see here 6.35 diameter the and uh, here also distance you will see 12.7 and we have four number of holes so let's do this anyone we can create so i'm going to select this face sketch now activate a straight slot okay press escape key to out a smart dimension and let's define this diameter is 6.35 divided by 2 9.525 okay and uh, one more distance from here to outer edge 12.7 similarly distance from this outer side 12.7 look these drawings seems fully defined now activate extruded cut feature and here in direction one keep blind and let's choose through all see here okay now let's i'm going to activate linear pattern direction i'm going to select any one this direction feature directly choose now here is spacing and instances let's say spacing 31.75 look this is moving forward and two number of instances everything keeps same okay look now activate mirror right plane is suitable for and here by default feature to mirror already selected see you will see the preview say ok now that's it now our model is complete i hope you like it don't forget to share and like our video and please subscribe our channel for more video and more projects in solidworks thanks for watching